And just lastly, on Sports Day 2, the fascinating journey of footballer Fallon Somaili. She's a Burundi international, but more recently left Africa to pursue a career in England. Yeah, that journey took her to Bradford City. They play in the fourth tier in England, and Fallon has already proved quite the hit this season. This is her story. <laughs> This is a special opportunity to play in England. I am motivated to work hard here so that those who are looking up to me back home can say, Fallon has worked hard and has made it. We can too. This is the team I started with in Burundi. They are called La Colombe. This is me here. Did you figure out about Bradford? As soon as we settled in Bradford, I inquired if there was a women's football team. I was told about Bradford City women. I went onto YouTube to learn more about them. I was impressed by the quality of football and I knew I had the skills to play in that team. All I needed was someone to introduce me to them. The caseworker wrote to Bradford City Women FC, telling them that there is a refugee here from Burundi who's a footballer. Would you allow her to come to one of your training sessions and try her out? They replied and said, no problem, let her come. If she's good, fine. Sawa. She's great on the ball and she's quick, so as a centre forward, that's what you look for. It's great to have her around the team and ensure that, you know, no matter where you are, or who you are in the world, you can make it and, and do something. Now where's her? I have the ability to take this team far, but my dream is to become a great player and play for the great teams in this country. While you are still working, you can't say you have succeeded. The successful ones are people like Lampard, Zidane, Pele, Maradona, Eto and Drogba. They have made it. They are now retired and can look back and say, I was successful. For me, I'm only starting. Hopefully, I will be able to look back one day and say I have been successful.